back to Pinpoint Weather, new at 530, a live look outside, another warm and dry October day. The question is, could this be one for the record books? Let's get over to meteorologist Liz McGiffin, who's tracking that for us. Liz. Well, today was right on trend where not only did we see above average temperatures, but we saw plenty of sunshine instead of any moisture in the rain gauge. So far for the entire month of October, we've only picked up 11 one hundredths of an inch of rain, which actually puts us about two thirds of an inch of moisture behind what you would expect to be at this point of the month. And that 11 one hundredths of an inch of rain, it came spread out between two days on the 18th and the 21st, which you'll notice both days we didn't even collect a tenth of an inch of rainfall. At this point, we're sitting in the top 20 for driest October's ever recorded. Assuming we don't get another drop of rain, well, October of 2024 would mark its would make its mark as 12th driest ever recorded for the Denver area. And remember, these record books, they go back to the 1870s. Thankfully, though, as we look ahead to the next week, there is a big weather shift heading our way by Wednesday and of next week, we could be talking about not only a drastic drop in temperature, but both Tuesday and Wednesday are bringing along the promise of some much needed moisture to the area. Chief Meteorologist Dave Frazier, though, will be back in just a few minutes with the timing of that and just how cold we could be after that cold front moves through. All right.